You're coming in. It's go time. What are you yeah, thinking go, right go, now? Go. I'm thinking, wait, line it up. Don't stay, stay on track. Wait for that. Wait for it. Wait for it. Then he goes. Went out. I'm like, we did it. We totally did it. Now you're actually pulling back on the joystick as he's going right above you. You're gaining altitude because I'm coming in. I'm coming into the ramp, sinking already with the towing, so it's pushing me down. So I gotta compensate with a little back stick to keep it level. I don't want to go high, and I don't want to go too much lower because I'm pretty much scooping the mud. I could probably touch the mud with my hands. We're really low. All right, here's a question on everybody's mind. What's, that? What's it like looking up and seeing a 12,000-pound Monster Jam truck flying over your airplane? It's like being on the surgery table and having a doctor take out your heart. Because I, I, I was heartless, man. I, I was nervous, scared, the whole thing, all, all together. Did it feel like that moment where he's passing above you went quickly, or was it almost like it was in slow motion? It was, it was slow motion, 100%. Yeah, I felt like everything just slowed down. You know, so um, I'm just happy to still be here. <laughs> That's incredible, man. Your timing was executed to perfection. Tom gave the go-ahead to Heavy D. You were in the perfect position. My man. I mean. Words can't express how awesome this that jump timing was. Is so, like, it, the timing was a miracle. Did That's all make, there is to it. Did we just make history? We just made history, <laughs> my friend. That's right. That's right, bud. Yes.